The Skeptic Fence Show, a bi-weekly secular progressive talk show with your host, Joe, TJ, Drew, and Paul. In the news segment. Well, the, the first I was going to say is here in Texas, it's not, we're like 96 to 98% Christian in Texas. Mm-hmm. And we have the nation's fifth highest birth rate amongst teenagers. We have the highest rate of repeat birth among teenagers. That was one of the things I want to say because there's a lot of abstinence only education there because it kind of ties into that. But the statistics I found are that more than 70% of abortions are from women who claim a religious affiliation. The Cooter Report with your host, TJ, exposing stupid with a horn kicker award every episode. Okay, so let, let me get this straight. Your prayers are so powerful, your intercessory prayers, where you're doing things on behalf of other people, right? And you're with your prayer leaders, all right? And you're like, I have a premonition, we need to pray for the Naval Yard in Washington, DC. And so they're like, that's kind of random, but okay, well, let's pray for it. But then the shooting happens there anyway. And they're just like, oh, you know, but it wasn't as bad as it could have been. Huh? What? Skeptic of the Week, where we feature a channel that you may enjoy as much as we do. I was thinking, you know, when it comes to any kind of a conflict in these arenas, it's really the atheist that has to watch his back. It's really the atheist that has the fear of being ostracized. There seems to be some kind of an unspoken alliance between people of faith, even if they're from different faiths. And don't forget our special guest every show. And now that I'm an atheist activist, my father sees it as his failure. Uh, if only I had been a better father, if only we'd gone to church more, if only we'd done this more. It's a battered partner syndrome as far as I'm concerned, right? And after that, we didn't speak for like half a year. And essentially what had happened was he chose an invisible father over a flesh and blood son. Mm. And um, this happens in religious families all around the world. And I'd like to see that go away as soon as possible. So. Thank you for making me terrible Agreed. over there. Here's a small list of previous guests we've had on the show. You can enjoy these interviews on our website at skepticfence.com or by subscribing to our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash user forward slash Skeptic Fence Show. Oh, and don't forget the post-show after party. Who said it? Bullshit. This this comes from your religion. This is your holy book. Fusion crust. Who said it? Greenhouse effect. You should know this shit like the back of your hand.